Hey y'all, it's your girl Zari from ZZ's Try and Honey, y'all know what I said. Y'all know I put the bloopers in here. Blooper number one. Okay, let's start again. Hey y'all, it's your girl Zari. Welcome in ZZ Tribe and new friends and family. Come on in, take your shoes off, leave the negativity outside the door, and let's get cooking. Today we're making some vegetarian pot pies. Instead of chicken, if you want chicken, usually this recipe calls for um, rotisserie chicken. And this recipe came from my sister-in-law. We'll call her Shell. It came from her. And um, it's really, really good, you all. It's real simple. It's real easy. I already put my cream uh, mushroom soup in there. But this is what I'm using. I put one can of cream of mushroom soup in, in, in my skillet. And, I, and also, I have, I cut up some fresh shiitake mushrooms and that's going to serve as my chicken but like i said if you want chicken in yours just use rotisserie chicken okay and you cut up the you, you can go to sam's or wherever you get your rotisserie chicken from and you can cut it up in small pieces and put it in your pot pie it's so flavorful you'll like it like that then i got some peas and carrots i got my trusty knife that i stir with it's dirty because i've been stirring my mushroom and i got uh my puff pastry to go on top I got my deep dish pie crust and you want deep dish because you want you're going to be putting that filling in there and you want it to be able to hold your filling so let me show you what I have it it doesn't look that appetizing right now but these are the mushroom and then this is the mushroom soup Okay, so I'm going to stir that in there. I think I'm going to open another one because I don't think this is going to be enough. So, really, what you're going to do is, uh, you're going to put everything in the same skillet together. And now, before I did this, I always wash the top of my soup off. Um, before I started cooking, uh, that, before I showed you this or before I came on the camera, I cut my mushroom up. I slice them up in, in uh, slices and I put them on the stove in some butter. I saute them in butter and I season them up with some complete seasoning and, and some, uh, what did I have? Complete seasoning and some Lowry seasoning salt. Let me grab that out so y'all can see that. This is the complete seasoning. It makes it taste like more like a, a heart is hardiness. I'm not going to say meat. It makes it taste more hearty. And then the seasoning salt. Of course you season it. Then now I'm going to take everything and put it in the pot. I'm going to let the, the mushroom soup cook a little bit. Then we're going to add the vegetables. You know we got to get my trusty knife, don't you? Cut this open. The peas and carrots. What y'all doing today? What y'all got on the stove? Uh-oh, what y'all cooking? Ugh. Okay, y'all. And this is my little, I got my little bag right here. Y'all know I keep a little bag for my trash. And this little thing I had, I had uh, cut my mushrooms up in this bowl. So I'm just going to throw the parts that I didn't use away. Okay. So, uh, of course we got some candles lit for some ambiance here. And what y'all drinking today? I'm not drinking anything right now, y'all. Not nothing right now because I'm, I'm in my zone. Okay. So, I had turned the stove down a little bit because I was waiting for y'all to come in. So now I'm going to turn the stove up more since you all made it here. And as I, you know, I, I'm always saying as much as I can, I appreciate you all for being here. Thank you for coming again and coming to check me out. And y'all know every time I turn on this camera, I'm looking at my forehead, but I'm trying to embrace it. 
<laughs> sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. But I do appreciate y'all being here. And I always take my crystal out because I say always because I, I'm a routine person. And people say don't use always, but that's my word, okay? Um, I took my crystal out because this, this crystal keeps me centered. And I bring it out to share with you all to help you all be centered as well. Um, and... You know, just to keep us in blessings. And this is this right here uh, stands for love. And we want to share love and spread love. And I try to do that all the time. And you know, I'm telling you guys on a regular that um, I'm not a perfect person. But I work on being positive and trying to share my positivity with others. So that that positivity can spread throughout. That is what I I am here for. I think that's my purpose on earth is to be positive, to share because I'm very nurturing. Oh, I got some food on my clothes. And that's that's who I am. So why fight it? Just find positive ways of uh, putting that energy out there in the atmosphere of the universe. Um, and for Christians, just, just being blessed, you know, and, and doing my thing. So I'm going to finish cooking this show. And thank y'all for coming in and watch part two of the video to watch the finished product. Hey, okay. So come on back and check me out because I know last time on, uh, the last time I cooked, you all said that you wanted to see the finished product. So I'm going to have to do a part two video to show, uh, to show you all the finished product. Okay. Love, peace, and hair grease. And as I always say, ah, holla.